You know, I have always been interested in textiles that that start losing their textile quality, their fiber-like quality, and start encroaching into the territory of another medium. We work with pure silk, and we also work with precious metals, such as gold and silver. I describe my creative practice as a continuation of a, of a heritage, of a legacy that's really 2,000 years old, that I am merely a someone who continues an enormous contribution that has been made over the centuries by many peoples of the world, many cultures of the world, tens and thousands of craftspeople, artists and designers who've worked with the craft that I practice. And very importantly, even though I'm maybe the face of my workshop, um, I also see my contribution as being inseparable from the people, the craftspeople who work with me. And it's really their work, I think, that I celebrate. In, in, you know, in instances like this, where an artist must collaborate with a traditional maker, it can't merely be about my creative uh, impulse, about my creative uh, output. And therefore I see my role really as an enabler, as opposed to, uh, uh, you know, the artist who, uh, you know, who, who sort of walks away with the credit. <laughs>